Good morning, dear students. Today, we will study about how to create a file, how to save a file, and how to open a file. So, first of all, I would like to tell you how to create a file. Always remember that when you create a file, a file is always created in an application software. Okay? Always remember that a file is created in an application software. Now, I'm sure that in your mind, the next question comes, what is an application software? So, this application software you will study in class 3. So, no need to worry about it. I will teach you in the next class. You just remember for the time being, you just remember that whenever you create a file, you need an application software. Okay, now let's start the procedure. So, first of all, when I say that you have to create a file in an application software, so obviously you have to open an application software. How to open it? You can see this is which button? A start button. So click on start button. Then click on all programs. Okay, click on all programs. Now after this, click on Microsoft Office and then click on Microsoft Word 2010. So basically this Microsoft Word, okay, this Microsoft Word is what? It is an application software, okay. Microsoft Word is an application software. Now you can see on your screen that a white page, a blank page has opened. Okay, now you can see this is what? This is a cursor. Okay, this is a cursor. Now, let's see. Now, what I say that we have to create a file. So, what I will do, let me type a name. Let's say I have typed Sham. Okay. Then, his age, he is 42 years old, okay, alright, so I have typed his uh, name, that is Shyam, his age, 42 years old, and let's say his phone number, okay, so these are the basic details, this is, I have created, I have typed something, okay, so this is how to create a file okay this is how we can create a file okay now once i have created a file obviously i have to save a file okay once i have created a file obviously i have to save it why do we save a file we save a file so that we can use it in the future whenever we need Okay, we can open that file whenever we need it. So, right now I have created a file. Now, I have to save it. So, for saving a file, what I have to do is, I have to click on the file tab. Okay, then click on save button. Which button? Save button. Now, once you click on the save button, you can see on your screen, a save as dialog box has opened. Okay. A save as dialog box has opened. This is save as dialog box. Now in the save as dialog box, first of all, I have to choose the location. Why to choose a location? We choose a location so that we can specify where my file is being saved. Okay. We choose a location. So that it is specified that where I need to save, save my file. So I have choose the location desktop. Why desktop? Because on the desktop it is very easy to find a file. Okay, so I have chosen the location as desktop. Then this is file name option, file name box. 
Now in the file name box, I have to type the name. I have to type, I have to give the name to my file. Let's say I have given name. Okay. The name of my file is name. Okay. And then what I will do? I will click on the save button. Now when I click on the save button, you can see here, the file name is saved as name. Can you see? Yes, the file name is saved as name. So this is how I have created and I have saved the file. Now, the next topic or the last topic in this chapter is opening a file. Now, when do we open a file? We open a file when we have already created it. Okay, we open a file when we have already created it. So what I will do? Again, I will open Microsoft Word 2010. So what is the first step? Click on the start button. Then click on all programs. Then click on Microsoft Office. And last step is Microsoft Word 2010. Okay, now I want to open that particular file. So what is the step? Click on the file tab. Click on open. A open dialog box has opened. Okay, a open dialog box has opened on your screen. Now what was the name of my file? It was name. Okay, the name of the file. The name of my file which I created just now was name. So I will type the name of the file and then I will click on open. Okay, it's saying file name. Okay, I have created on desktop. So choose the location also. Okay, first of all choose the location and then type the name of the file and then click on open. Just a minute. From the uh, choose the location. Now, here I have to find my file. What was the name of the file? Name. See here it is. Select and then open. The file is opened now. Again, I will tell you what is the step to open a file. First of all. Open that application software, Microsoft Word 2010. So what you need to do is, first of all, click on the start button. Then click on all programs. Click on Microsoft Office. And then click on Microsoft Word 2010. Okay, after that, click on file tab. Go to the open. The open dialog box will open. Okay, now where I have saved that file, I have saved that file on the desktop. So, click on the desktop and now here find your file. This was my file. Okay, so I have selected and then click on open. The file is open now. So, this are the, these are the basic steps which you need to remember how to create a file, how to save a file and how to open a file. I would request you all to kindly practice all these three things in your laptop if you have. If you have your, if you have your personal PC, if you have your computer, then practice how to create a file, how to save a file and how to open a file. Thank you children.